rock and roll, hip hop, rap, pop, R&B, country, rock. What do you listen to when you're glad, sad, or hyped? Do you remember the first song you ever heard? Probably not, but you most likely remember the tune that you first identified with. That song and artist that spoke to the deepest ends of your heart. Music is often an outlet for teens and a way for them to express and explore emotions that lead them to an identification of self. Studies by the University of Glasgow reveal that the music we identify with during our early teen years often becomes the music that stays with us throughout our life. Every day on my way to school. Uh, I listen to music every day. Uh, that trap music is hip hop, you know, like you hit that whip or that nay nay or that hot, hot N word. Rap. For an R and No, not really, because like I, like I sing to music and like dance to it too. No, I wouldn't. Um, it helps me stay up with trends, you know, like going up on a Tuesday. You know, that, you know? It cheers me up, it makes me a happier person, and people like to see other people happy. Mm, I don't know, like, it makes things less awkward, so like, when you're at a party or like, a get-together, like, nobody's talking, you just play music. Well, as Mexican, my mom listens to different types of music, so culturally, I'm aware of different types of music. It helps with your mood, like if you're sad, you just put happy music and you get happy. It has connected me with like different, different cultures. So what's your favorite song? Do you know why it's your favorite? Music has allowed us to connect with not only those around us, but with our true selves. How would you be without it? Luckily for you, you must have worried. There are musical tunes and lyrical inspirations all around us. As you go on with your experiences, obstacles, and challenges, remember that being under the influence of music makes this world magically better.